Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having an amazing day. If you are new here, make sure to subscribe. And if you do enjoy this video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. In today's video, I'll be showing you guys how to make the background of an image transparent. So without any further ado, let's get into the video. So the app you will be needing is Photoshop Mix. This is how it looks like. And it is completely free to use. When you open the app, you're gonna click the plus button on the left side. Select image and then click on your picture. So first we're gonna start off with an easy image, the subscribe button. As you can see, there's a white background around the subscribe button and that's what we wanna get rid of. So what you're gonna do is tap on your image and then select cut out at the bottom. Once you have done that, these options should appear. Then click on the option that says auto at the bottom. So then the screen should load and with this picture, Auto pretty much did all the work for me. Then you're going to click on the V in the bottom right corner, and pretty much you're done. What I like to do to make sure that all the background is erased is add an image in the background for contrast. What you're going to do is click the plus button and then press color. I'm choosing a dark blue, and then I'm just dragging the subscribe button layer on top of the blue layer. So as you can see, the subscribe button is perfect. So what I'm gonna do is delete the blue layer. To delete the blue layer, you're gonna click on the layer and then press delete. To save your image, you're gonna press the share arrow at the top and then save it to your camera roll. Now for a harder image, this popcorn. As you can see, there is this white background around the image and I wanna get rid of it. I'm gonna start off by doing the same thing we did to the previous image. We're going to press cut out at the bottom and then select auto. This time auto got rid of some space that we didn't want to get rid of. The gray squares mean that that part is transparent. We're going to fix this by selecting the smart tool at the bottom and then dragging your finger around the general area that needs to be filled. At the left, there is an option subtract to get rid of the unnecessary space. Do you think you're done using the smart tool, you're going to press the V at the right corner. Then you're going to add a color in the background to see if everything is right. As you can see, there is red space in the popcorn, so we have to go back and fix that. So I select smart and then drag my finger around that place and fix the other spot that also had red space. Another cool thing you can do is click refine at the bottom and then click feather and drag your finger up and down to smooth out and lighten up the edges. Then you can also click on edges and select different options to change up the look of your edge. But for my case, it's not really necessary. So then I pressed on the V and it looks like my image is perfect. So the final step is to delete the red background and then my image is completely finished. So that was it for today's video. I really hope you enjoyed it, and if you did, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. 